You're going to need a pair of socks that matches your hair color. I got black because I have dark colored hair. If you have blonde hair, then I would suggest getting maybe a beige colored sock. If you have blue hair, get a blue sock. If you have red hair, get a red sock. You get the picture. I got my socks at the dollar store, so super inexpensive too. You're also going to need some scissors to cut the sock. A hair tie, definitely possibly a second hair tie, and some bobby pins. Take one of your socks and using your scissors, cut off the tip right where your toes would go. Once you've done that, you should have two ends that are open. It should make a long tube like this. Now that we've done that, you can begin to roll up your sock. Just take the end of your sock that you just cut off and start to roll it up like I'm doing in the video. And once you're done doing that, you've reached the end of making your sock donut. You should have something that looks like this. Off camera, I actually took the second sock and cut it in half and used part of it to layer over my sock donut to make it bigger and thicker to make my bun even bigger. Now place your hair in a ponytail. Wherever you put your ponytail, that is how high or low your bun is going to be. Now take your hair and grabbing the sock donut, you're going to slip that onto your hair like so. Just like that. And you're going to slip the ends of your hair through the hole in the middle of the sock donut. Now take the ends of your hair and you're going to start splitting those over and on top of the sock bun. Make sure you get those all evenly laid out. Grab your hair and start to roll it, just like when you were making the sock donut itself. But now that you're making the bun, the hair is wrapping around the donut. If you have hairs that are flying out, you can just grab those and tuck them back into the center of the donut and continue rolling. Roll until you get to the very end of your bun, all the way up to your ponytail holder. Now take some bobby pins and use those to pin any flyaways that you may have. Pin it at the bottom, top, and sides for a secure hold. 